Hi, we're the Harsh Twins, and we're back in the gym, and we're going to show you how to perform lat pulldowns. Lat pulldowns is one of the best exercises for your back. It's helped us make all kinds of gains. All kinds. And we're going to have Dorian here, and she's going to help us illustrate how to perform this exercise correctly. But I'm going first. Yeah, you do that first. This is my machine. I don't want her to snap something. <laughs> yeah, so Go we ahead and show the exercise. <laughs> now, a lot of people make the mistake when they perform this exercise. It's a back exercise, but they turn it into a arm workout. So what you want to have is the mindset when you're pulling the bar down to your chest is to pull with your elbows so you're engaging your back muscles. Because like I said, this is a back exercise. It's not an arm exercise. And I feel it a lot better uh, in the back muscles when I do this exercise is when I pull it down to my chest at the bottom part of my chest. And something else you can kind of do, it's, it's a little trick I like to do, if you're not really feeling it in your back, if you shrug your sh shoulders before you start performing the exercise, they help you engage your lats a little bit better. What do you think? You think you can do this? I think I'm ready to give it a try. All right. You want some of this? <laughs> I'm going to get me a couple more of these reps first. <laughs> How's that weight feel? Is that too heavy, too light? It's good. It's, it's good? good? Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. Really want to really focus on your lats and your back. Make sure you've... Really engage by pulling with your elbows. Yeah. Your hands are pretty much there to hold the bar, not yeah. to pull the bar. Yeah. And on the way up, you want to keep constant tension. You don't want to have your arms go all the way straight. Yeah. yeah. There, you, there go. you go. Yeah. It's a great way to keep the tension on your muscles while you're working out. If you're locking out, yeah. the tension, all the tension is, is going on your yeah. joints. Yeah. You want to work your muscles, not your joints. Right? Your joints don't grow well. They grow. It's called arthritis, right? <laughs> you, want you, don't want your, you don't want your joints to grow. Yeah, don't be that mean. I don't want you to snap something. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't meant to be funny. It's meant to help you. But anyway, I get what you're doing. Yeah. But anyway. <laughs> Great exercise, right? Yes. Yeah, you want to get some? Yeah, let me try it. Let me try it okay. out. Okay, at home, you're watching. Join me on this set. You know how to do the exercise correctly now? Yeah. Again, I like to pull the weight to my chest, really squeeze my lats at the bottom of the movement, and I'm pulling with my elbows. My hands are just holding the bar. It's not pulling the bar. I'm pulling with my elbows. Yeah. Oh, man, I feel all kinds of erections in my back. <laughs> those muscles. <laughs> you feel the blood getting drenched in those muscles? Oh. That's like what I you said, want. Feels like erections. <laughs> Pump that blood in the muscle. Great exercise for your back. Yeah, you should be, um, when we do this exercise, we do anywhere from four to six sets, and we try to stay between six and 12 reps. Again, when you perform the exercise, you don't want to go necessarily to failure. Right. You want to stop right before you hit failure. Yeah, one to two reps before you hit failure. So if you max out at 12 reps, you want to st stop at 10 reps. Yeah. You want to stimulate your muscles. You don't, yeah. you don't want to annihilate them. Yeah. Got to leave gas in the tank for the rest of your workout. Right, You don't right. want to burn yourself out in that one set of exercises. But right. I tell you what, if you do this exercise, you'll make all kinds of gains. All kinds. Hey, thanks for watching MoveTube. Make sure you hit that like button and click subscribe. And you're going to make all kinds of gains. All kinds. All kinds. It was beautiful. <laughs>